So hello and welcome to more adventures of Konoha. As he is still in the, the nice and peaceful land of the torrents of Mogor. Now they are having some uh, goblin invaders which we'll probably be dealing with today. But first, before we do such a thing, we have to uh, connect a bit with our Loa. Let's see. Uh, what could be a good spot to gain some spiritualist uh, happening? I guess we can do it near the giant totem. Hello, big sword. What are you doing there? Stabbing. Okay, that's good. Let's see, is there a sign on this side? No, we should uh, go into the front of the big totem. Ato, would you mind going away a bit? I am going to have a slight spiritual moment here. Yeah? So let us uh, kneel. And let us roll up a new holy quest for today. What will we be doing for our holy powers and our respawn thing, which we'll put, have put right here? You see, this will keep track of how much respawns we have left. We have finished uh, one quest last week, so we have one respawn that we can use. So that might make uh, life a bit easier for this challenge. Because, you know, as fun as it is to go to go to high, like, like the go to high the 28th, I, I think the restarting is going to get tired uh, at some point. All right. Anyways, let's open up our quest stone. Whoosh. Let's see what holy quest we will be getting today. Let's roll it. Roll nine. Now keep in mind, uh, last week we completed, uh, yeah, we completed quest number nine, so we might as well roll for eight, because we are not going to do the qu same quest in a row. So roll eight, let's go. Number four. Let's see, number four is... Learn from other warriors wielding the shining light. Get a higher reputation with the Sunwalkers, Argandon, or other light-aligned faction. Okay, so we have to... Find out where the sun walkers are. This might be tricky. We are in in uh, Torn lands, and sun walkers are basically Torn paladins. So I gotta do some research into how we uh, how we get uh, to them. But let us put the quest in our log. And locked. Okay. Now we just have to research. Uh, how to do uh, if the Sunwalkers are even like a faction we can because honestly I did not research that I know they're kind of an organization uh, in, uh, in 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 the, in the world of Warcraft among Tauren society they are Tauren paladins as it were but I don't know if they're actually like a separate faction that you can earn reputation with so we'll have to research that else we might uh, we might translate that into gain reputation with the Tauren because that sort of makes sense But uh, yeah, let's first head on over back to quest mode. Onwards back to dealing with that venture co mine over there in the mountains. You actually see it. So that is where we will be going. I think I'll first check on that reputation thing. So if nobody minds, I'll just do a quick bit of research. Uh, online to factions and actually on my sheet I can actually have a look at things so let's see uh, titles reputations here we go uh, so far I do not see them separately we do have thunder bluff where we're friendly but we could get better we would probably need to get to armored let us just see if that is actually a fact faction so one second Half of the exemplary Sunwalkers to be a brave defender of the Horde and follower of their ways. Sunwalkers' first duty is to preserve and protect life. As a young Sunwalker continues their training, they will grow closer to the light, associated with Anshi, which gives them their powers. So, to some, they appear pacifists. But I don't know if they have, like, a separate reputation uh, faction... No, I don't think they actually have like a separate reputation uh, or such uh, with them. 
So we will just make it uh, to get, say, our uh, honored reputation with the Torn. That seems fair. That seems perfectly fair. So let us change uh, our quest log a little bit. Okay, there we go. A little bit more refined quest to go for today. And something we are well on our way with. So that is good. Yes, let us... Uh, be uh, exemplary members of the Horde and help the Tauren as best we can, so we might learn of their mighty paladins. So I'll first to uh, get uh, get to the goblins that uh, that attack these lands, and to drive them out with their greed and all that. Like, what do they want to do with all that gold and such? Build a city of gold? Our professors, only we are allowed to do that. Because we are very holy, damn you. Hello there, Venture co-worker. I'm here to smite thee! Feel the holy wrath of Godai. Actually, what we might actually do in this case, uh, if we open up our character sheet again, we can put the reputation up with Thunder Bluff as a as an experienced bar so that'll be handy there we go now you have uh, the green bar is our reputation okay oh you have big ones here as well these are more of a of a proper challenge i shall smite the invader i need to go into the mine so let us move forward Forward! Fight through the ranks! You shall fall before my righteous uh, protector might. Leave these lands! Out of my way, you big dumb creature! Hero coming through! I also have thought of a maybe new quest we should add to our quest list, which would be Avenge Our Kinsmen. And the quest would be kill the creature that previously, uh, that previously killed our, 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 our kinsmen, aka one of our previous, uh, previous attempts. Only we had a use for all that holy power. Oh, here's for Supervisor Fitzel Sprockle the Bug. Oh, we don't want to be on fire. Okay, the fight is on. He is using a lot of tricks. But no trick can stop the holy strikes of Godai! I've... Oh, there's another one. Gotta watch out, see, we can get swarmed in here. Or not die as my, as my kinsman did in a cave. Uh, we still need to kick two, but we can do that on the way out. And we should activate... Troll healing. Right back in full. Hello, the small one. I am making you still an example. Leave. I already got your boss. And now you, as big one, you will be my last. Why do you throw it when I'm standing right next to you, you stupid creature? Hero! Can we get out this way? Uh, yeah, technically. You know what, we can do the cool move again. Uh, not embrace the lower. Terror swoop! Oh, that's nice and fast. 
very nice and fast. Oh dear! More in Cloud Stalker. I have vanquished or hit the enemy hard. They shall be forced to flee from my troll might. Well met. The Outrunner's duty is to ensure the safety of those who travel across the plains of Mulgore. Those who threaten the safety of our foreign homelands risk punishment at our hands. Yeah, I got uh, this one guy punished. Real bad. I am like a punisher. Yeah. I see that with anger at the thought of the atrocities that Venture Co. Is, in is willing to perpetrate against us in the name of profit. Yeah man, it's, it's real shitty. They really want gold too much. Goodbye. They should just settle that we have a city of gold and have a kind of like a trade uh, trademark on it. My anger is somewhat lessened at the news that the villain Fitzprocket is dead. I will go through his personal facts and see if any of that additional information about Venture Corps has plans uh, for the future. Thank you for your efforts, Go to Hive. No problem. Go in peace. And that did earn us a nice big chunk of exp uh, of reputation with Thunderbluff. Very good. We're on the right track, yeah. I didn't. I don't think there could be too much misinterpreting or ignoring the signal. Hmm. Ventureco will know not to take torrent li torrent lightly or be so arrogant as to believe we, could, we would allow them to steal our natural resources without protest. Ancestors, watch over you. Yeah, good. Keep with your man. Right. Another nice chunk uh, of, of uh, reputation. Uh, there, oh, that kind of leaves us uh, wondering if there are might be more quests to be doing. Uh, we haven't really gone... Oh, there might be still be quests here. In Thunder Bluff. Battle for Azeroth mm. mission statement. Sacred burial. Let's go to the other side of uh, Thorin lands. So we must learn well from these mighty creatures. Here we are, a new village where we can roll into town and become a big goddamn hero. Hello there, Iron Eagle Talon. What brings you here? Go to Hive. My brother soon stands before Chief Bloodhoof, and it is my honor to make his headdress for him. I want to ask a favor of you. While I finish tanning these leather, leather straps, there is not uh, no time for me to find enough feathers. I was wondering if you would gather more for me. You can find feathers and collect uh, the correct size from the harpies residing to the north and northwest of Thunderbluff. I need only six azure and six bronze feathers to complete the design. Can I have a headdress? Because that sounds cool. Hmm, these armored legs actually are a little bit better than what we are currently wearing. So yes, cool. let's take this quest. And you know, reputation. We are now need to be heroes to these people and learn from them. But I would really also like one of those feather headdresses actually. Only the most valiant of Thorn are laid to rest in Red Rocks, our sacred burial ground. It is an honor bestowed upon the courageous war great warriors who helped uh, found and defend Thunder Bluff, and those who have given their lives for the greater good of the tribe and the chieftain. And thank you, Vitakonine. Sleep well. Hope it, uh, it's a nice uh, tale to listen to. But it appears a foul presence has makes its way into our holy lands. A band of bristleback interlopers is ravaging the graveside, and I am too old and past my prime to drive them away. They must be driven out off with force, Coda Hive. Oh, I know a lot about driving things off by force, man. We be doing this thing. Okay, that's two new quests we picked up. Alright, so let us begin with number two, because it's closer. Wind Fury Sorcerers. Those look like the ones we need to fight. Hello there, ladies. 
What lovely blue feathers you have. What lovely blue other things you have. Oh, no. Wait, let's go to high now, French. And uh, go to high is at least level 14. Hopefully we won't be leveling too fast. But yeah, we do have to do quests, uh, solid amount of quests today. To gain that ooh so juicy oh. reputation points. Wind Fury Matriarch. Let's see if they have interesting fellas. Hello, baby. I'm looking for chicks. <laughs> yeah, that is a rare spore. Let's fight her. Gotta watch our hit points. You never know with these uh, rares, but I think we're good. Ah, victory! An imbued simple cape. That is better than what we got, I think. Yeah, we just have the one armor. And this is two armor and stamina. Much better. And it's a nice red. Sweet. Okay, last one. Life is a whole lot easier when you actually have at least one offensive power. Okay, now we need to find Bristleback Interlopers. That will be over there, so let's mount up. Get there quicker. Oh, so it's Bristleback, it's Pikmin! Smash the Pikmin! They are kind of like I don't know, because they have quills. Uh, porcupine. Right, keep an eye on our health. We don't want to suddenly be without. Let's see if I can grab the ore, then smash one more and get out of here. You will then be the one more, I guess. I wonder if these are all ladies or if the, the quail boars all have boobas. I mean, I don't mind them all having boobas. Grab the copper. glorious mining and let's get out of here yeah quests completed done uh, we can actually do our fun little trick again I think yeah could have gone even farther if we had been up higher on the rock or something but this was a, a fine escape I strike deep and hard for justice, and then I fade back into the night like some sort of Batman. The winds guide you. This headdress will certainly be wonderful gift for my brother. Okay, can I have one? May the eternal sun shine. Thank you for your help, Cordahive. My brother's pearl ceremony is almost complete. Giving him the headdress for witness to the ceremony are all duties for cry of me. Walk with the earth. Ooh, and they got an upgrade. Let's have a look. Thirteen, uh, three strength, five stamina. I think that's actually a bit better than what we got. We got nine armor, two strength, three stamina. That also critical hike, height, and haste. But no, this is better. And new equipment, which is nice in itself. Hurrah. They look kind of like the old equipment, but they're better. 
Now you, uh, did we get experience points uh, or any uh, reputation for this? Hmm. Don't see we got any reputation of this. Little bit. Hail. Well done. You send those foul bristlebacks a clear message. They will think twice before attempting to meddle with our holy spot again. Level 15! And we got... Um, chests. Let's see if that's actually better. Uh, let's open up the sheet again. So, currently we have um, for our chest... Light Soul Battle Blood. It's 10 armor, 2 strength, 3 uh, stamina and some critical hit and versatility. Well, this one does... Uh, let's see. Strength is the same. Stamina is better, armor is better. So I think we should probably equip this. That looks nice. Looks solid. Slowly we start to get actually better equipment, which is nice.